Welcome to the We On podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we journey into orbit with the crew aboard China's Tiangong space station, where three Taikonauts find themselves without a pathway home as their return capsule was reassigned to a different crew. But what unfolded next left China facing an unexpected and complicated challenge. China seems to be in a bit of a pickle as three more of its astronauts are now stranded in space. The capsule that was supposed to bring the Shenzhou-21 mission crew back to Earth was used by the Shenzhou-20 crew since their vehicle was damaged by space debris. So now, the next crew in line is left with no option but to extend its stay at the Tiangong space station. Zhang Lu, Wu Fei and Zhang Hongzhang of the Shenzhou-21 mission have been living on board China's Tiangong space station since October 31st. They were to take over from Taikonauts Wang Jie, Chen Zhongrui, and Chen Dong, who were supposed to return to Earth on November 5th. However, their return was jeopardized when a piece of space junk reportedly hit their capsule. They were forced to spend more days on the space station until the Chinese space agency made arrangements for them. The affected spacecraft was found to have a crack in the viewing port, so CNSA decided to have them board the capsule designated for the Shenzhou-21 crew and brought them back on November 14th. But that meant the next crew was also now stranded in space. Space News reported that the China Manned Space Agency, or CMSA, will send an empty replacement return capsule, dubbed Shenzhou-22, on November 24th, for the new crew. However, there is no official confirmation on the same. Experts have raised concerns over the safety of the replacement crew who might be affected if any more space debris hits the Tiangong space station during this time period. In this scenario, they have no way to make a safe return to Earth in the absence of their original return capsule. The Shenzhou-21 crew is supposed to spend six months aboard the space station, but it is important to have a spacecraft at their behest in case of an emergency. The decision to return the Shenzhou-20 crew without having another return vehicle in place has triggered speculation that the Tiangong cannot support six Taikonauts at once. However, the CNSA has previously refuted such concerns. The damaged Shenzhou-20 spacecraft will likely be detached from the station and deorbited into the Pacific Ocean once the new capsule reaches the Chinese space station. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.